do a before and after the Kaufman shorty pipe baffle. Uh, so, yeah. Pair, flapper, snorkel mod. Uh, on that stock except for the pipe, of course. Uh, bought it without the baffle. Went ahead and sourced baffle from Kaufman direct. Installed it, uh, but didn't do a sound clip prior to putting it in. So I'm gonna go ahead and do one with and uh, without, and see if you guys can tell the difference. Maybe let's see. It's not much, it's just uh, there's that clip right there. You squeeze it and the baffle comes out. It's not much to it. It's maybe 10 minutes. So we'll, uh, we'll check back in a second. Okay. Yep. So it took, uh, I don't know, two minutes maybe. Uh, baffle, snap ring, shims. There's a rubber washer there. It's, seated on there pretty good but when I bought this it actually came with a new rubber washer it's just seated on there pretty good it's got maybe a hundred miles on it uh, so yeah now it's it's, it's open in there uh, let's see right away is it's definitely louder uh, get a little bit more of the, the burble on the back pressure definitely a little throatier deeper uh, now that I've heard it back to back I don't know which one I like better I'm not sure um, I ride with earplugs so I don't really hear uh, it that much different to be honest with you um, but I mean it sounds pretty good with and without to be honest uh, but uh, not covering up the wheel and just going with the shorty pipe to me personally is the way to go uh, and it's not too this thing isn't too expensive either but there's pipes that come up and take up cover the entire wheel at, in it's not my preference, but uh, anyway, maybe get some uh, data out of this. Get a little before and after. See if that helps you guys make a decision. Peace.